subject is gas leakage detection, auto exhaust, and rebooking. I'm Samiha, a third year biomedical engineering student at CJ Anna University. Good morning, everyone. I'm Mohammad Farvejiri. I'm a pre fine year mechanical engineering student. Uh, Myself, Pratpada Puran, pursuing my undergraduate pre mechanical engineering second year. I'm Arunayas. I'm still doing my third year ECE in CEG campus, Anna University. So, we are doing a project under CEG Tech Forum uh, to be presented in Kurukshetra 21. Uh, our project's title is LPG Gas Leak Detection and Alert System and LPG Gas Level Detection and Auto Booking. These have two separate uh, projects and I'll be explaining each of them individually. So at first I'll explain the first project that is the LPG gas leak detection and alert system. So the problem that I'm going to address here is that say for example there is a leakage happening at home in the LPG gas cylinder but you are in your bedroom but you wouldn't know that there has been a leak until the order reaches your bedroom but you cannot wait until that happens because it is highly dangerous and you cannot uh, guarantee that uh, and there's nothing else will explode in the kitchen until you uh, detect that there has been a leak happening. So we have come up with an idea where we will be placing an MQ5 sensor at the valve of the cylinder such that when there is even a minimum amount of leakage you will, you will be notified. So the way we are going to notify this is by using a buzzer, an exhaust fan and an SMS to your mobile number. So this is mostly the owner's mobile or someone close to them. So what we are going to be using here is an Arduino board and uh, the buzzer is here, this is the fan and here is the MQ5 sensor. The MQ5 sensor is nothing but a sensor that helps us detect the gas. It not only detects the LPG gas, it also detects smoke or fire so it, it performs more than one function. You can use it either way. Uh, the reason why we are using a fan here is that, say for example you are not at home but there has been a leakage happening. So in that case we will be uh, detecting that there has been a leak at home and you will get an SMS to your phone. Also automatically this fan gets uh, activated such that uh, even if you are not at home the house is safe. Even if there has been a massive gas leakage happening you will get a uh, notification. Also the fan has been activated and hence you are going to That's what we are going to do here. Uh, I'll explain uh, all the components that we are going to use here. This is the Arduino board that is the main component that uh, will be uh, used here. Um, uh, to connect the Arduino to an external supply we are using a cable through which we will be uploading a code. This code has been uh, uh, done by me and uh, in that we will be uh, adding all the features of the buzzer, fan and MP5 sensor. So that's the thing. Here is the GSM module. GSM module is nothing but a module that helps us uh, send, receive calls and texts. So that is what this is being used for. This is a motor driver. Motor driver is being powered by a 9 volt battery. So I will now uh, upload the code and I will show you how it works. Uh, here instead of uh, sorry, instead of an LPG, actual LPG gas, I am going to use a light cigarette lighter which has the same type of gas inside it. So I will be using that to uh, show that the, uh, show that the gas has been detected. So now I am uploading the code. So through the serial monitor of the Arduino board, I am being told that the PPM level of the air concentration is 30. So now when I am applying this gas, the PPM level rises to a certain uh, a certain uh, level that is, I have, uh, for example, I have used 1000 here. So when that level is being reached, we will uh, we'll be activating the fan, buzzer and lesson stick. So I will show you that. So as you can hear, the, the buzzer has been heard and the fan is being activated automatically. This is because the leak is being sensed by the MQ5 sensor. And as you can see, I have received a as you can see I have received a text message in my mobile. That is this. So this is the first part of the project. So the, the, the basically what ha, what I have done here is that uh, leakage has been happened at home and uh, when that happened uh, as SMS uh, has been uh, sent, a buzzer is activated and a fan is activated. So that is the whole uh, aim of the project and it is being done. So now I will move on to the second part of the project that is the LPG gas level detection and auto booking. What this basically means is that whenever a gas cylinder is about to get uh, uh, about to get over uh, the this particular sensor this is one of the load cell sensor which senses the weight uh, this will uh, sense that the weight has been uh, reduced and when it comes down below a particular level uh, 
level uh, this JSON module is being used through which we can call the uh, government uh, gas booking uh, company. By that we can uh, book a gas on our own automatically without any manual help. So uh, since we are not using an actual cylinder here, I am going to use this particular block as a weight. So when I, when I take the weight off, uh, it means that the cylinder is, uh, is, is is almost to get over. That is the energy I am going to use here. So when it is uh, on it, it means that the uh, cylinder is full and when I am taking it out, it means that the cylinder is about to get over. That's what I am going to do. Uh, so the port has been already uploaded and I will I'll show you how it works. So for now, I am I'm keeping the uh, weight over the load cell. So when I take it out, I will get the call. Since the uh, since I am not going to actually call the company right now, I have programmed it in such a way that when I take the weight off, I will get a call to my mobile. So I will show you how it is being done. It will take a moment or two until I get a call. So here it is. I am calling, I am using the SIM card that I am using here is a BSNL SIM and uh, through which I, I have gotten a call. So that's the whole project. Uh, so I will remove it now. So I will the electricity usage. So the, the main uh, problem here is that we had the, the LPG leakage and we have activated the alert system. That is part of it. And the other part is that uh, detecting the weight of the cylinder and the uh, uh, booking and uh, cylinder automatically so that's what I've done here uh, me myself and uh, along with my teammates have uh, done this project my individual project the individual contribution to this project is that uh, uh, myself and one of my team members have bought all the uh, components together and uh, I worked to connect all of these and uh, I have contributed in my, doing my own code here so that's the overall contribution of mine to this project so that's the thing now my team members will be explaining their contributions to the project. My contribution to this project is using the centrifugal blower to remove the gases. Uh, since this is our prototype, this is the prototype, we don't have the actual setup here. In our actual setup, there is a funnel like arrangement which is located near the cylinder. And the other end of the cylinder is connected to the centrifugal blower. You may also think why we are using this centrifugal blow here when we already have the exhaust fan in the kitchen. Let me explain. First of all, the centrifugal blow here is fixed outside of the house. The other end of the centrifugal blow here is connected to this funnel like arrangement which is located near the cylinder. Uh, when, the cylind when the centrifugal blow here is actuated, it will run outside of the gas medium. So that is, that is less possibility of getting fired due to an electrical spark. When we use the exhaust fan, the motor of the exhaust fan will run inside the gas medium. So there is a high possibility of getting fired due to an electrical spark. The next advantage is, since this funnel like arrangement is fixed near the cylinder, it will suck the gases first, then the surrounding air. When we use the exhaust fan, it will first suck the surrounding air, then the gases. Because of these reasons, we use this centrifugal blower in our project. Thank you. Hi. So my contribution is the coding part for initiating the automation. My individual contribution towards the respective project is selection of the MQ5 gas sensor and the working principle come the idea of buzzer alert system. I have also been engaged with the rotation fan speed varying with respect to the LPG gas leakage detection level. Apart from this, I have also been contributed by purchasing the required components and also helped in the assembling the same. We have done this project under the CEG Tech Forum. We would heartily thank our student mentor for guiding us in each step and hence we are able to learn a lot through this project. Thank you.